Oh god. Okay, yeah, so Bubsy 3D is looking real good right about now. I assume we have to jump on the bubble. Oh. Let's begin with some MS-DOS games. So let's see what a 90s attempt at translating a board game into a PC game looked like. Wait, is this trying to say that if I play alone, that my decisions are caveman unga bunga? Let's operate. Just choose your tool and we'll begin. Hmm, I think we should use our tool. Careful as you guide the tweezers to the piece and remove it. Don't... Don't what? Great! Oh, that's so weird. Oh, this is so fucking weird. What is this thing? Do we have this inside of us? Also, how big is this dude? His body just keeps extending. Wow. How could that be healthy? Like, we just did a sensitive operation, and then, like, a wind tunnel sucks the dude out into the great beyond. <laughs> I would almost classify this as anti-fun. Well Much like clowns are anti-funny. Does he have anything stapled to his groin? For $100, you could staple his sack. Move that swell little cowboy germ with your mouse. What? Click the left mouse button to jump. This is so fucking bizarre. Nifty! Ooga. Me, Neanderthal. Well, at least if you don't want to play the shitty operation game, you can just do this. What is this? Cave spin. Little uh, dinosaur fellas knocking about with the uh, caveman fellas. Dole f uh, five a day adventures. Is this a banana game? Five a day and you're doing it right. Five veggies and fruits from morning till night. Have some juice and all the things here. They come from places both far and near. So five a day is the magic rule. Mom is okay. Less is uncool. Wow. They want those nanas jammed down our throats. <laughs> that is awful so, hey there dudes like i'm bobby banana <laughs> you could drop into our town it's like, it's like really great to see you click on any of the building bars i'm like get going <laughs> hey my dudes welcome to club banana would you like a um a mango margarita the salad factory if you like fruits and vegetables then they are good for you are there any chat members who are on any kind of recreational welcome drugs at the moment factory. In our factory, you can make your own salad and learn which fruits and vegetables help make a super salad. Click any food item to get started, and I'll show you how to make your salad. I gotta say, I'm kind of proud of the chat, because as far as I can see, not very many people want to fuck the salad. I was expecting the whole chat to be like, yeah, give me that salussy. Cauliflower is so good. Are you ready for the challenge? What do you mean, the challenge? You are entering the challenge zone. What? What if I click the exit button? Is that also good? Uh, I'm Pamela Pineapple. Are you okay? Today, yeah, Pam you Pamela Pineapple got a lobotomy story. recently. Apples are very old. We were mentioned in the Bible. Yeah, the Bible. As in, like, the fruit that the snake tricked Adam and Eve into eating. It's starting to come together now. Oh, banana. I want to see banana, bro. Deliver fact, my banana hey, dude. dude. My name is Bobby Banana. Oh, I'm the most popular fruit. Are you? Yo, did you know that bananas are picked when they're a green color and eaten when they turn yellow? Okay, you're going to read the rest? Or did the dude pass out in the VA booth? All right. Want to see my movie? <laughs> Welcome to Five A Day Top Tunes. Oh, no, it's fruit music. Broccoli is my name you hear. I swear to God, if this gets copyright claimed, I, am here to make it clear. I will never eat broccoli again. All right, let me hear the cauliflower song, you freaks. My head is white and my leaves are green. <laughs> I'm one of the best snacks you ever have seen. Wow. I will spell <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why are we spelling it slowly? All right, fine, Salad Sisters. Do you think they actually got Dolly Parton to do this? Fetish unlocked? Get it? No! No, it's salad. The other fruity dudes chose me to tell you all about another great pyramid. It's famous, too. The food pyramid. This pyramid oh, doesn't have any mummies. Actually, it's full of food. 
people are saying that that has been disproven and it is com completely outdated by now. Turkey shrinks your dick. Well, that would be weird. Please bring back the salad girls. I need to see the salads getting tossed and covered with dressing right now. The banana bro has no sex appeal. The broccoli has no sex appeal. I only crave one thing, and that is the salad sisters. Hi, I'm Lucy Iceberg Lettuce, and I'm the main ingredient in salads. I am a great lettuce choice for your salad. Immediately, chat starts ranking their favorite lettuce. Who is best lettuce? Uh, celery, we, we gotta go on an adventure, Celery. Who is vegetable Rick? I guess that would be Pickle Rick. Oh my god. Yeah, this thing's a piece of shit. Let's go do something else. These dinosaurs found peace and happiness living together in the land before time. Welcome to the Great Valley. I'm Littlefoot, and these are my friends. Spike's like, don't make me speak, I'm chewing. Now, chat is telling me, trying to, to impart upon me cursed information. Yeah, maybe right now is not the time to know this information. Let's let's enjoy the Land Before Time activity center before Where the, the volcano. Click on the bones in the sinking sand, then drag it's, the pieces yeah, across ch the screen chat, it's to put necromancy. them together. Clear the screen by selecting the trash can. What do you mean trash can? There were no trash cans in dinosaur times. This is just scientists now, or paleontologists trying to put together dinosaurs. Oh, we don't have to stop at one pair of, like, <laughs> the Kremlosaurus. That's my new... That's my new dinosaur, OC. Oh, that's a printer. I forgot, there was a time where every game had a printer button. Chat, this is the next legendary Pokemon. Behold. Join Ducky in a fun game of dino trivia. Which dino's mother was killed during the Great Earthshake? Wait, what? Like, in real life? That's a strange question. Which dino was killed? Yup, yup, yup! You got it! You <laughs> Someone wrote trauma trivia. Hey everyone, dragon. it's me, John Bobo, the trauma clown. Yeah, Today we're steps. gonna be talking trauma trivia. Which of these dinos likes to eat and sleep? But what if this movie didn't exist and this was just like general dino trivia? Dinosaurs, true story, loved dying. They just they loved it. So this is the one that people thought was scary. Okay, so it's like an actual maze, like 3D. Like the Windows screensaver kind of thing. Okay, so you have to collect the object, including a prehistoric bungee. Well, can we go through? Oh my god! That really is like prehistoric bungee, holy shit! Let's just wait a sec while all that funny stuff gets ready. I'm trying to find out now, why did this give people nightmares? Aside from how shockingly terrible the controls are. Okay, I can kind of see that. Thing just fucking pops out of nowhere. Has like a kind of a scary face in animation. Yeah, I, I can kind of see it. Destroy the child. Destroy the child. child. Someone said there's a cutscene where a meteor comes down and destroys all the dinosaurs. I, that that's that's Japes, right? Controversial figure, Mr. Potato Head. Check out my clubhouse. Hey, gang. Come up and play in my treehouse. Mushroom Dr. Kingdom! Center. Here we come. This is just making it too easy. Seriously. I love to play dress up. I'll lend you. That's kind of your thing, isn't it, Mr. Oh, Potato Head? Please. I mean, this better be a good, fleshed-out, dress-up feature. <laughs> Dr. Potato Head. I would definitely trust this doctor. This is who I'd have work on my fucking gallbladder. We need clown shoes. I guess that's close enough to clown shoes. Yo, Mr. Potato Head was the original NFT. Moose? What do you mean, moose? Squirrel? You, you just put squirrel and moose on the shoes? Comical tiny skateboard. Oh, there, there's my, uh, my potato head. You're one hot spud. Ugh. Get well soon. Hi, Grandma. <laughs> Hi, Grandma. Howdy, Grandpa. Howdy, Grandpa. And then you give them a potato head. <laughs> this is the next Vine Sauce shirt. 
Vine sauce. Howdy, Grandpa. Hey, with a printer, Thank this would have been amazing. Okay, time to paint. Let's start with finger. What are we starting with? What did someone, someone in chat said, said something? I really hope my wife doesn't walk in on me watching this. Are you watching a grown man play with Mr. Potato Head Activity Coloring Book Center? Lemmings 3D. The fuck is this music? It's 3D music. Well, I like Lemmings. I had Lemmings on the Super Nintendo. Oh man, those 3D graphics. Holy shit. Oh my god. Wow, it's like real life. Um, so you, you hold right-click to look around. It, it, the com camera controls are pretty confusing. Oh, oh my god. Any child playing this would have, it, have an aneurysm trying to comprehend it, says a chat member. There's an option to grind your lemmings to dust? Oh, those are some awesome 3D graphics. I mean, everyone had to try to get into 3D at some point. Not sure what I have to do up here. I, I don't know how to play this game. Oh, nice, we got Armageddon. Nice! Nuke them lems. Yeah, I don't think I have the brain capacity to try to figure this out right now, chat, so let's just go ahead and um, move on. Lawnmower Man, it's finally here. By the turn of the millennium, a technology known as virtual reality will be in widespread use. Meanwhile, it's just people staring at their own avatars in a mirror over and over again. Chat, this happens. Jump now. Jump now. <laughs> Wait, is this because I failed the jump? One more man's in your head now. There's no escape. Ever. Okay. <laughs> That's some fucking hot garbage. Okay, I, I did it. I, I passed the first jump. It's it's up. Oh, that's confusing. Don't tell me to jump and then say down. I hate it so much. That that is a wretched scum game. I don't like it. I don't want it. We're gonna move over from DOS to like Windows 98 type stuff. God, man, fucking demo discs, intro cutscenes. Back in my day, when you would buy a magazine, it would come with a demo disc, and you would get your own story in the demo disc. Once inhabited by inferior DOS games, Station X now contains only the best games for Microsoft's <laughs> Windows 95 operating system. Basically, we were told if you like MS-DOS or ever used it, you're a fucking nerd. <laughs> Chat. Remember? You don't know Jack. If you're having like a competition with someone and you're like both really good at you don't know Jack, would that be called a jack off? So you're playing with yourself, huh? Okay, pick a category. CB lingo. Wow. Blast from the fucking past. At a rest area, a fellow trucker comes up to you and asks you about your Reaper. What uh, you what the about? fuck? Your refrigerated trailer. I wanted to say trailer full of hogs. But chat members told me. Cold. How many bras would that be? Oh man, a Donner po Oh my god, these fucking categories. But listen, Indiana Jones. The famed archaeologist quests for the Ark of the Covenant takes him into a Jewish synagogue. He has no choice but to take his bullwhip and perform an impromptu bris. This literally has nothing to do with Indiana Jones. It's a fucking circumcision. What a way to frame a question. Oh god, what is this game's questions? ACDC, guys with balls. Yeah, beat balls! Fat! Balls. How often do you do it? Which of these events is best described as happening once in a blue moon? Go volcanic eruptions. Volcanic eruptions. Time for the attack. It's not any old match we're looking for. It's the one that fits this clue. You said a mouthful. M Mork and uh, and Mindy. Niner Niner. I don't know who JJ Evans Evans is. What? Oh, I'm bad at this. Joe Friday. Steve McGarrett. I, I, oh god, this is stuff from fucking 25 years ago. Excuse me. Oh man, your jack-a-jack totally sucked. Let's see how it damaged your score. 
<laughs> you don't know Jack. Someone said, is this, um, like a boomer version of the Jackbox party game? This is the first game that- where do you think Jackbox came from? <laughs> there are many, many demos. One more. Hold on to your nuts. What's hold on to your nuts? This peaceful valley is the home of this weasel, a graceful woodland creature that is part flying squirrel and part weasel. Their world is about to change. Something is coming. Squirrels and nuts. Hey, it's time for action! Attention! <sighs> Gravery! Microphone peaking! I don't even know what kind of game this is gonna be. A platformer, perhaps? Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. I didn't realize it was going for a psychedelic visual experience, but here we are. Oh god, the music is so bad. <laughs> this is so bad. I need to know how long before or after Super Mario 64 this was. 97? Wait, why can I... What? I really hope the game didn't ship like this. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, we gotta jump, we gotta jump, and now, okay. Oh man, these graphics really, really hurt my brain. <laughs> how, how did they think this was good enough? Good. That was MS-DOS quality. Trash games, crusts, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. Johnny will figure it out. Johnny's good at that. Thanks, Johnny. We like Johnny. Why are the Teletubbies still up? I, <laughs> I turned that game off so long ago. It's the ghost of the Teletubby game. Chat, this game doesn't even have a disc. Oh, they're all corrupted and fucked up looking. Unable to find custard. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I can't believe I did this. Like, how does this even happen?